this video lecture I am going to discuss what how to install PostgreSQL on Windows 11 operating system. The first important thing there you should write PostgreSQL. So here you can get HTTP and PostgreSQL.org site. So click this site then you need to click on this download. So this video about for Windows 11 operating system. So click there. After that, here you can see download the installer. So click this link. Then if you scroll down, so here you can see Postgre X. 86 and 64 so that means that is 64 bit operating system 4 so Windows Mac Linux and Linux 64 so here this is the latest version 14.3 so you need to click on this download button after that uh, there you can see the download will automatically start okay so I already have so now I'm going to install that. Okay, so this exe file that I already downloaded. Now, so this is here on the download and programs. So this is here Postgre 14.3 Windows 64 bit operating system that's for. So double click on this exe file and after that. Uh, here you can see edb postgre sql so here set up postgre welcome click on next so this location they are postgre going to install if you want to uh, install this on the other than c you need to click this button after that click on next this here you can get postgre sql server pg admin stack that's all fine command line tools click on next so data directory this location next and here this is the user post Chris post Chris and you need to set the password so remembering password you should give so I have given the password then after setting that click on next and this is the port 5432 next and this is here local so you can select the default it's fine click on next and next next and now you can see please wait while setup installs postgre on your computer so this is unpacking and this location where postgre going to install so it's installing so it will take some time so I'm going to pause the video. Please wait while setup install Postgre so it's done here. After that to the next is completing the Postgre setup wizard. So launch a stack builder at exit. So here a stack builder may be used to download and install additional drivers this all. So I will do it later so let's click on finish. Now the next is let's here search PC admin. PC admin for so here this is now PC admin management tool for Postgre SQL. So waiting for PC admin for to start. So PC admin there you can get the database, insert the database tables and many more. So whatever you set set it the password at the time as time of installation of the Postgres you should give and after giving the password ok then you can see this is your PC admin this test board properties SQL and many more so here click on this server then this is the database Postgres SQL 14 so give the password once again then after press enter then you can see here database so database inside there you can see so this is the postgres is the database and inside this is the list of users 
so this is the user's postgres this is the master user and after that uh, here you can see this is so uh, here oh, so many things like schemas so here schemas inside schema this is aggregator collection domain and many more so here you can see the tables also okay so let's uh, right click on the tables then you can create the tables okay so if you click on this create tables so there you can give here the tables name let's give here test one and schema is public that's uh, and this is the owner and click on this save so table created after that there you can uh, specify columns here create columns and many more things then if you want to do the delete you can do and truncate and uh, so many operations you can do here okay so if i click on this post gris so this is the database okay so here you can create the schema database foreign data wrapper language and many more things okay and uh, this is here call lesson so you can create the call lesson and uh, so many things you can see inside there so this is the most uh, simplest way we can install PostgreSQL inside Windows 11 operating systems. So I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.